we're just piecing them up. Absolutely frying them. They don't stand a chance. Well, I didn't ask the team in the league play. The other team was not so bad. The 200 health, bro. Just shred it through the armor. Shred into the armor. Oh, that's a cluster. We're out of here. Hey, bang, bro. They are just up close. He has karma in his clan tag. I'm going on Twitter. He's an optic fan. Oh no. And let's go right into lead play, guys. This is the weapon. I know, okay. I, I, I can talk a little bit better. I look a little bit better. My cheeks aren't as fat, but I still sound a little weird. Uh, I'm getting better though. I'm feeling a lot better. So this let's get back to the main point of the video this is the weapon you guys should be using uh after it received a buff the swordfish is probably one of the best weapon everyone wants the gun ban everyone wants it gone they want to delete it from the game and i'm going to give you a few reasons and show you guys in the game or show you guys in my gameplay why a lot of people want it gone why a lot of people think it's op and everything let's get right to the gameplay and show you guys this but before that i want to show you guys what i use i use reflex quick draw one quick draw two and fmj on it so if i need to shoot to any fences I can shoot to the fence. I need to aim in quick if someone's sliding on me. Quick draw and quick draw two. I'm gonna slide in really quick. And then reflex for the sight because the original, the default sight in the swordfish is completely trash in my opinion. I really do not like it. And then I just use tag mask, dexterity, dead silence, just some basic perks. And then obviously the stem shot so I can heal up a little bit quicker. But uh, let's get into the gameplay. I'll show you guys why people think this gun is the best gun in the game. What is good, everyone? We got Arsenal Hardpoint right now. Oh, no, it's Control. Oh, okay. Arsenal Control. Arsenal. I, my bad. I got confused. Honestly, the last few games I was playing got kind of unlucky. People were just leaving the game and stuff, and it just, I wasn't feeling it. Like, you know when people leave the game, you're just like, bro, this is just a vibe kill. I don't even want to keep playing. So I was just like, you know what? I'm out. Oh. Okay, well, I'm in A by myself. There's people attacking me, and this gun absolutely melts them. Wow. Those guys stood no chance. Oh, I almost got him again. I almost got him again. Let's go, teammate. Get the trick. It's all good. Good try. Good try. Listen, if my teammate gets world starred, I'll be like, it's okay. Like, I'm not going to be like, you suck, you idiot. You are trash and all that stuff. Like, I'm going to say, good try. I've tried your best. It's okay. At least you tried, man. As long as people are giving me their effort and, like, working hard and they don't leave, I'll. I'll oh, shit. Oh, I, almost, I got world starred, guys. No. Carmen is clan tag. I'm going on Twitter. He's an optic fan. Oh no. Okay, now my teammate's shooting me good. But yeah, like I was saying, as long as my teammate tries and they put the effort in to like make a play happen or try and try and do something, and they get world star. Kind of like I got world star right there. I will never, I'll never be bad vibes and be like, oh, dude, you suck, you're trash, you idiot. I mean, I might if I'm like in a raging mood, but for the most part, I'm gonna be like, okay, you tried your best, you got gun, it happens. I'm not gonna be too mad at you for it. Come on. So one shot. So one shot, bro. Both of them. Uh, dude! Okay, now I'm gonna get mad. So my team, I don't like when my teammate shoots me in the back. Uh, at, least we got, at least we cleared out the hard point. Thank God we cleared out the hard point. I'm gonna lose my mind. My teammate keeps shooting me in the back. I don't know if they think it's funny. I don't know what they think. Let's see if we can stop it. I'm gonna try to make a hero play. Usually you wanna play smart in these situations, but it's league play. Let's see if we can make a hero play. Nope, the hero play got shut down. Wait, wait, wait. Alright. King Phil. Five to eight. No more respawns. So this means we gotta go big, big. Good team shot. They actually might all be flanking. One tango left. All right, there we go. Okay, that round was filled with ups and downs. We started off bursting people. Next thing you know, I'm getting turned on. Okay, you hate to see that. Absolutely hate to see that. I don't know who it was. Who was it? Oh, I, I can't tell. Their emblem had karma in it and the goat thing, so they definitely know about competitive calls. Oh, it was Skittles. Yeah, Skittles turned on me, bro. Oh, my God. This guy is turned. It's all right. We won the round. That's all that matters, right? All right, we're going to go back in A. We're gonna shut it down with our swordfish, and we'll be good to go. 
will be good to go. Hostiles contesting Bravo. Nice. Oh, baby. Let's go. Let's go, team. We're working on streaks now. We're working on streaks now. Oh, we tapping B. I'm going to help you guys capture B. Let's make sure we get this point. B is usually the harder point. Bang. Burst. Again down. We do have a Tempest. We should pull it out and just secure the easy round victory. Well, you know, we're going to keep the Swordfish out because the Swordfish is nasty as well. Come on, peek me. Don't give me my shrieks. Don't give me my shrieks. Let's go. Sliding out. I don't need no team. Okay, maybe I did need a team. There's four of them there. Team. Team, stack the point. Focus lobby. Oh, let's get it. Pure denial. Absolute unit. Let's see. We might need to get one more break on this. Actually, oh, my teammate won the big 1v1. Oh, he's locking it down. Let's go, Rarester. Push him out. Get the piece. Get the piece. We sliding out. Let's go, Rarester. Come on. Where they at? They don't want no smoke. All right, let's get it, baby. Up 2-0. We're absolutely killing it. I got my Tempest. I got some Shrieks. Listen, the Swordfish be bursting. I'm telling you guys, the Swordfish, the thing about the Swordfish is, honestly, in my opinion, it's really, it's not, at long range, it's obviously good, but it's very good for picking people off head glitches. And when you pick people off, like, it's just so easy. When someone's on a heady and just standing still, not even strafing, and you strafe out and hit him with your first burst, you're going to melt him off if you need to with your second burst. Like, it, the aim assist, it's just how the aim assist works. And um, that's why it's so good for melting people off headies. And another thing that makes it, what makes it even more OP is the fact that you can kill people up close. Like, that guy, when he shot me in the back and I was able to snap on him with my swordfish, obviously that's, like, reaction time and shot and, like, skill and stuff. But if you, ha if you have that, which a lot of people do, uh, you can easily just snap on them with a swordfish and just destroy them. All right, they're going B heavy. They're hurt. Okay, well, they decided not to... Oh, no. There's one more. They decided not to run side when we had a Hellstorm being called in. That was an uh, interesting play, to say the least. But, yeah, up close, this swordfish is actually really good. That's what makes it OP. Actually, we're losing uh, let me shoot the door open real quick. Oh, dude, I wanted to, like, shock one of them and chains all of them. Okay, Rare Sure. Oh, you can just go in there with your grab spikes and absolutely destroy all of them right now. King Phil, I appreciate you baiting for me. I appreciate the baits. Oh, no. If I'd have landed a second earlier, jumping always kind of messes you up in this game. It's looking like we're going to be able to close this game out. A nice, swift 3-0 on control arsenal. Uh-uh-uh. a little bit alpha. they're gonna spawn back right accidentally crouch it cost me a kill and i got flanked oh brother oh brother yeah, yeah we're just piecing them up absolutely frying them they don't stand a chance well i didn't ask the team in the lead play the other team was not so nasty 200 health bro just shred it through the armor shred into the armor. oh that's a buster out of here. Wait, bang, bro. They are just up close. Just, we already got out. Well, guys, the swordfish is pretty good. You can see from a few of those kills. I'm probably going to go shoot a few bots and just, like, show you guys when there's more people to kill. Obviously, it's lead play. Sometimes it's hard to find people. And, um... But, yeah, no. This gun is just super good. And if you've been watching any professional player streams... Or have seen some other YouTube videos of people using this weapon. The, the potential of this gun is just so high. Because it's so good up close. It's good medium range. And it's good long range. And it's good for taking people off head glitches. Like usually there's some kind of recoil. But there isn't really any recoil. If you get hit, you really don't move at all. And it's just so easy to rip people off the headies. And that's what makes this gun so valuable. Alright guys. And right now we are actually in a bot free for all lobby that I'm hosting. This is like a good way to warm up your shot. A lot of folks professional and top players do it just uh, get their reaction time warm get their shot warm get their movement up and uh, ready to go before the, the uh, pro matches and such but like i displayed in that last league play game aside from getting turned on that one time um just how good this gun is like you can just 
maneuver on the map so easy and just melt people. Obviously, these are just bots, but just the fact that you could like slide around and be so mobile with this weapon is just insane. And look at a tree's right there. I'm shooting through that tree easily. I got FMJ. So make sure you guys are using the perks and attachments that I told you guys to use. But this, this gun is so good. It has so much ammo. It doesn't move at all. Wait, wait. I actually want to get into a gunfight where someone shoots me. So let me like hit a guy. Wait, look at that. Look at that. I got armor too. Look how much health he has. Shoot me. Get it. Threat like, neutralized. I guess that is kind of from Dex. Wait, is that from Dex 30? Or like, what is that from that you don't flinch a lot? But I don't know. You don't flinch at all. And it's just absolutely insane the fact that you don't get a flinch. And like, it's just. This gun is just so good, man. So if you are not using this weapon and you want, and you want to win and give yourself the best chance, especially if you're an AR player, heck, even if you're um, like a flex player like myself, you can use SMG, the AR, whatever it may be. Using this weapon is probably going to be your best idea. And I'm sorry to all the people that hate this gun, because there's probably going to be a lot more people in League Play using this after they catch on to this video and they show their friends and stuff like that. But look at like that guy shoot me first, bang, bang, just instant. And this is actually probably my new favorite special. This one is fun. This one is fun. I love the Outrider specials right there. Let's go. Come on. Let's go on a little streak. Gotta get the shot on point. Gotta get the movement on point. I'll flick. Oh, gotta reload, gotta reload, gotta reload. Oh, I stopped shooting. Bro, you do like so much damage, I think it looks like you're gonna kill them, but you actually usually hit them with two bursts. Let me try and get a clean one burst with this, actually. Oh, you think you're flanking me? Come on, come on, come on. You think you're flanking me, bro? I'm twisted. I'm cracked. You are not flanking me. So you definitely need to hit a few headshots. You need to hit a few headshots, or is it all your bullets? Yeah, I think it's a, like a headshot. Because I'm pretty sure I'm hitting all my bullets, and I'm not getting a one burst. Okay, yeah. So if you hit a headshot right there. One second, let me heal. Okay, yep. So you have to hit some kind of headshot. If you don't hit any bullets to the head, you are going to kill them in two bursts. But if you do hit at least one or two bullets to the head, you will kill them in one. Okay, bang, headshot, easy, easy work. But obviously when you're playing a real game, it's not too smart to aim for the head. You want to consistently aim for the biggest part, which is like the chest area, the body area. That's usually the best spot. And sometimes when you get shot, it will Tangle bounce down. your aim up and it will hit them in the head, which can indirectly get you a headshot somehow. But yeah, that is it with this gun. But this gun, this gun just shreds hell. Like this guy's armor right here almost killed him in one burst. So usually it's going to take two bursts with this weapon if you do not get a headshot. And uh, yeah, this is the Swordfish. And if you want to try it out, I highly recommend it. People want this gun gone. It's a very strong weapon. It absolutely melts everyone. It outclasses a sub up close sometimes. It outclasses an ICR long range sometimes. Don't get me wrong, the ICR still has its, its, uh, its times where it shines, but the Swordfish is just an overall better weapon up close, medium range, and long range than the ICR. And that's why a lot of people are unhappy about this weapon. I uh, hope, th hope this did help you guys a little bit. And thank you all for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video. And as always, my name is Attach, and I'm out. Peace.